sleeping in climate control all night. This is the uh, setup. With the windows. Worked out good. Got these little headlamps on uh, Amazon after seeing them on Facebook. They light the whole thing up. Kind of cool. It's, uh, just floods the area with light. But uh, I used it for that last night. It worked out pretty good. Oh man, so yeah. Oh. Yeah, my four inch uh, mattress. <laughs> God, it's like it's after 8 now. It's almost 8 30. I'm talking about getting the start late start again. Uh, uh, I slept so good last night. I got up twice. I think I got up once to go to the bathroom. And, uh, yeah, I woke up again just because I wake up at 2 o'clock usually. 1 or 2 o'clock, 3 o'clock. Uh, I'm going to get out and make some breakfast. Catch up with me over there. I'm gonna turn the car off and uh, if you put the price you paid for gas in whenever you buy it it'll tell you when you uh, turn the car off how much money you spent this time so I'll say about two o'clock in the morning I uh, I woke up and I had to go to the bathroom so I turned the car off and locked it so it'll be about twice this but this is what it costs to have climate control on a Prius at five dollars a gallon. Dollar twenty six. So uh oh, it didn't really work. <coughs> So to have air conditioning all night, it cost about two dollars fifty cents. That's at five dollars a gallon. That's fair. <laughs> we'll go set up and cook some breakfast. Boil some water and make some coffee. Got these little uh, folders packed. Basically instant coffee. It's all right. It's a job done. I was reading the box and uh, it says one of these packages for six ounces. Yeah. Two. Two of them gone. So like I said, the nice thing about these KOAs is it's it's safe and it's uh, there's a lot of people around. That's good. Um, another good thing about it is the showers and the bathroom. The bathroom's right there where they put me. So. Uh, Run the park or come to clean up and check the dog poo bag and all that. But it's kind of nice. It's, it's like a campground, you know, for the RVs and they've got tent spaces. And uh, that is a boil. Got my egg. Got my bacon. 
I've got my favorite skillet. Once this thing warms up, it uh, does pretty good. As far as regulating the heat, once it's cold, you have to kind of open it all the way up. It, it just doesn't want to run on the lower settings. Let me bring you in here so you can kind of hear better. How are you today? Good, how about you? I'm gonna be better here in just a minute. <laughs> I'm gonna start bringing in here a little bit. Look at this. Uh, now that's pre cooked bacon. Uh, it's just you're just heating it up. That's better. You're just heating it up, getting, getting it going. Cheers. Mm. <laughs> it's a little rough. Ah, uh, let's see. In here somewhere, I have silverware. There it is. My favorite spatula. So yeah, that's a good thing. Let's let that set over here for a minute before it gets too hot. I want to get my tortilla warmed up. So yeah, last night I was on the phone and a bunch of kids running around screaming. That's, that's kind of a drawback. You get you get the benefit of being in a campground with these, but uh, this one's busy. I've been to a few that weren't so much so, and it was nice, you know, off-season type of stuff. Uh, but you can see that the place is just full, and uh, there's little kids running around screaming and yelling it. <laughs> I don't mind that so bad. This morning, just now, before I started rolling here, uh, couple of little girls came up. What you doing? What's going on? You know, <laughs> we're going to Squirrel Town. I don't know what that is. Cool. I don't know. I don't know. And then their mom came up. And I'm, I'm the whole time I'm thinking, stranger danger, kids. You don't know me. I could be a weirdo. <laughs> oh, man. Anyway. It didn't make me mad or nothing. It just, you know, I don't know. I taught my kids to talk to people, but, you know, only when mom and dad was around. <laughs> anyway. All right, that's that pan warmed. And that is the tortilla, or California sandwich bread, as I like to call it. There we go. By the time this bacon's going, I should be able to bust that egg in there. And, uh... Unfortunately, I left the HP sauce with the kids. <laughs> yeah, I'll get this heat real quick, and then uh, I'm going to grab a... I'm not going to do a full-blown shower. Uh, what I'm going to do is just kind of wash my face and change the t-shirt and underwear and all that. Scoot on down the road. It's getting late again. It's uh, 9 o'clock now. Thank you for staying with the city, Cedar City KOA. We appreciate your business. Checkout time is 11 a.m. If you need a late checkout, please let us know. Be on the lookout in your email inbox for a survey to let us know how we're doing. They're actually doing really good here. It's a really nice facility. And it looks like it's been around a while. So Anyway, uh, yeah, scooted on out of town yesterday, topped the car off, canceled the car wash subscription. Uh, Recorded a bunch of BS about that. No fun to watch, so I'm not going to produce it. 
I wouldn't want to watch that, so I'm not going to subject you to it. <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah, I made it 470 miles, I think it said, Cedar City, uh, Utah, here it is on the map, and uh, not bad, not bad. Uh, I just got feeling tired and wore down and wasn't feeling good. I'll tell you, uh, you might think I wouldn't fit in that Prius like that, but I did just fine. I do, because I've done it. And uh, whatever was bothering me seems to have been something I ate. And this morning I passed gas in there. Oh my God, talk about being in an enclosed space. <laughs> That's not healthy. <laughs> <coughs> I tell you another thing is I'm my back is just tore up stiff and hurts and all that, but uh, climbing in and out of thing is not any easier than it was last time. If anything, it is just a touch worse. But I'm doing it, so I need to stretch more. Anyway, I'm gonna wrap this up. I'm gonna uh get cleaned up, jump in the car, and head on out. If I see anything cool, like what I'm going to close with here, uh, if I see anything cool like that, I'll, I will share it. But uh, a lot of that stuff I shared last time. So. You guys take care. Have a safe day. I'll catch you on the next one.